how to make chicken coconut spicy curry welcome to something's cooking and let's start with the ingredients to make this recipe you're going to need about half a kg of chicken boneless chicken then about 3 diced finely diced onions about 4 to 5 cloves garlic cloves finely chopped little cilantro or as you say dhania for garnishing little salt little pepper and red chili around about 3 to 4 finely chopped a little oil and coconut milk around about 100 ml to 150 ml now let's get started in a pan first you heat the pan let the pan heat up a bit once the pan is a little heated add about one tablespoon of oil this is a very simple recipe and it is absolutely delicious so oil is almost ready and I'm going to add the diced onions to this So I have added about three large onions to the pan. I'm going to wait till the time the onions are cooked. They have to be nice and golden brown. So I'm going to reduce the flame a little. Otherwise, it will burn the onion. So, looks like our onions are almost ready. Yep, they are ready. So, um, I'm going to add some garlic. And let it cook on low flame so now after uh, putting in the garlic it's been about a minute and now I'm going to add red chilies these chilies are not very spicy but they do add a lot of color and a little bit of tanginess to the sauce this recipe is gonna look very different than most Indian curry recipes. Most Indian curry recipes have a orange red color to it. This will have more, this will be more on the white side. So I'm gonna let the chilies cook for a bit, say about a minute. So looks like it's been a minute since I put in the red chilies. I'm gonna now mix everything together. This all I'm doing it on low flame. Make sure you do the same or else you'll burn more of the other ingredients. To this mix, I'm going to add the boneless chicken. Now cut up the chicken into bite sized pieces. So I'm going to add the chicken to this. After adding the chicken in the pan, uh, I have 
stirred this or I have cooked this for about 7 to 8 minutes. Now the chicken is almost uh, like say around 70-75% ready. Okay, it's on slow flame and it's all 70-75% ready. To this I'm going to add the coconut milk. And I can turn on the flame a little high. To this, I'm going to add about half a tablespoon, uh, rather half a teaspoon of salt. And about half a teaspoon of black pepper and I'm going to stir this and I'm going to let it cook for another five to seven minutes till the time the curry is completely ready. If you think that the curry is a little thick, if you think that the coconut milk is a little thick you can always add a little water to it and your curry is ready I'm gonna add a little dhania to it to get a little more color to our dish look at that so the color of this dish is just absolutely breathtaking and the smell, the aroma of this chicken looks very good. You can make it a little thick by adding a little less water or absolutely no water and you can boil it for a little longer. So voila, that was our spicy coconut chicken curry. You can enjoy this with rice or naan or homemade rotis.